What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Pretty much gonna explain to you why I'm getting rid of the cob exhaust. Um, but before I do that, I just wanna apologize to you guys. I know I've been saying I was gonna do every Monday and Thursday videos, but <clears throat> I had no content for you guys last week and then also my battery charger was on my mom's. And, and also, I mean, since I started Subaru, uh, I mean, coming coming from not working eight eight straight weeks and then starting to work all over again, a uh, full force. It's I'm not saying you put a toll on me, but I was fucking I was extremely tired this past week. Um, and then I, just, I all I wanted to do was just you know kick back and chill and relax. So I'm sorry for, I'm sorry guys I didn't upload last week at all. Um, so what I'm gonna start doing since I don't really have much content left, uh, comment down below what do you guys want to see. I mean I'm available. For, I'm Time for anything you guys want. I do have another video coming up pretty soon, which I just got the parts for. It's just a killer bee oil pan. Not for my car, but for one of my buddy's cars. I'm doing a killer bee oil pan, because unfortunately he fucking destroyed, annihilated that oil pan. As far as uploading every week, two times a week, I'm gonna try my best, but if not, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna do for sure one. I'm gonna try to do as best I can one video per week. Anyways, let's jump right into this video. Guys, enough of me talking about. So the main reason is uh, I wanted to go quieter, and don't get me wrong, outside the car it sounds phenomenal. I like I like the way it sounds, like how quiet it is. I mean, I like how quiet it is, but but the only downside of it uh, <clears throat> inside the car, it's, it's so droney. It's it's um it's raspy. I mean, for the quality, for the amount of that you pay, it shouldn't be this raspy. Like my girl's car, my, my girl's exhaust sounds a lot better than this. I don't know, maybe it's just the exhaust setup that I have running. Maybe that's why it's so raspy. But like, as soon as you start getting on it, it just gets raspy out of nowhere, and it's it's annoying. That's for one, and then number two, like I said, it's dronier than my girl's car. So that's another thing I don't like about this exhaust. It's just how drony it is. Like it makes my, like my head hurt. Like honestly, that even though the Tomei Y was fucking stupid, stupid loud, but it's still like it wasn't so droney inside. I, I don't know, probably because the resonator. And this one's not resonated. I don't know. So yeah, so I'm getting rid of this exhaust. I'm gonna go back to the Tomei. I mean, I'm gonna risk. I'm gonna say fuck it. And I mean, I'm already a hot boy as it is with the hood exists. So I might as well just full send everything and go back to being loud. And the Tomei, honestly, of all the of, out of all the exhausts that I've owned. That one's like the best sounding exhaust that I've had inside and outside. I mean, yeah, it's a little bit too loud for, um, you know, for California. You guys live in California, you guys know loud exhaust, that's a no-no for cops. Um, <clears throat> so that's why I went this route, but I'm not going to sacrifice my fucking, my ears. And honestly, I went to, I, went, I just went to San Jose the other day, uh, yesterday actually. I went to San Jose yesterday to go pick up some parts. And honestly, it's just... The most annoying way there and then going back like literally if you have the windows up the drone is just through the roof insanely insanely uncomfortable um i had to roll the windows down and just honestly i don't know and i haven't put my my fucking airpods on because <laughs> that's how annoying it was and like i said also sounds raspy um but i mean other than that i mean don't get me wrong the exhaust looks beautiful and, and i love how light it is it's actually probably a little lighter than the tomei itself but like I said, it's just it's just a drone. The drone I can't I can't I can't do with it. So I'm gonna do a little sound clips for you guys, just so you guys. I mean, I know the camera's not gonna pick up what I'm actually hearing and whatnot, but I mean, I'm sure you guys want to hear the exhaust anyway. So um, so for ex full exhaust, what I have pretty much. Um, if you guys are new to the channel, I'm gonna pretty much run down what I have. Um, <clears throat> so what I do, what I have is you know the Tomate cap back I mean, not to me <laughs> sorry that's uh, uh full cop titanium cap back uh quad tip of course um i'm gonna show you guys a couple you know b-rolls of this stuff and I'm, I'm, as i'm talking i'm gonna show you guys a little b-rolls but i have that i also have um a catalyst rotated downpipe so uh ets uh three inch all the way through um i have a big ass turbo uh, Comp Turbo 6262, and then I have a uh, ETS rotated up pipe. I have ETS V2 headers. So <clears throat> that's literally all the exhaust screen there is, honestly. But 
Um, yeah, I have that. And honestly, like, uh, yeah. But that's what I have for exhaust wise. Um, what's it called? But yeah, I mean, that's, pre that's pretty much it. That's pretty much all I have to say about this exhaust. I mean, I don't know. Maybe, maybe it's raspy because I don't have all the padding anymore that was in here because you know have the c short shifter um i don't know if, i don't know maybe that's why i could hear so much drone coming through it but it just sounds i don't see it sounds like shit uh like i said so and plus i mean i, I love the single legs out before single legs that over quad any day let me let me get the gopro let me get it all set up and then for now i'm gonna just do a little cold start for you guys So I'm gonna do a little around the block exhaust clip like on the bumper. I don't want to drive it like that on the street because if a cop sees me then I'm so fucked. But anyway, so I'm gonna do that around the block. I love my community. I'm gonna do like a little light pull just so you can hear. But then after that, I'm gonna do like inside the car to the car view. And then uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoy. Hope you guys like this video. Subscribe if you guys are new because it'll be a, it's gonna be a, it's gonna be a better one. I'm just waiting for the little mofo thing for the GoPro. But um. <clears throat> Yeah, subscribe, enjoy, and let's get to it.
was a fail. Uh, my coupler decided to pop off real quick, but I'm gonna go back. To, good thing I'm close by. I'm gonna go back and uh, get that thing fixed. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right, let me let me get back and fix this clamp, and then uh, and then we'll, we'll we'll try this again. Oh, all right, let's try this again. <laughs> I fixed it, so let's try another rip. Turbo noise is coming out of this.
So unfortunately, and then my clamp fell off again. The stupid heat wrap. Um, I think I'm gonna just take it all completely off and get my intercooler piping uh, powder coated. Um, so yeah, I mean, <laughs> that what, that's what happened right now. Literally, I was doing a pull and then literally that fucking heat wrap. It's, uh, that heat wrap is what fucking literally decided to say bye bye. But yeah, I'll show you guys right now. I ran it over. I don't know if you guys heard that. I don't know if the video picked it up, but that clamp is gone. Look at my phone. So I can show you guys a better angle. Yeah, but that clamp is gone. That clamp is gone, guys. Uh, just a clamp that goes here. So this this one literally just popped off like that. And look at that. <laughs> look at that heat wrap. You can see it. Look at that. That thing's shredded. <laughs> The thing is, I've been pushing it hard, hard. Well, I was pushing it hard, but only on sport. I wasn't even on sport chart. So, I'm gonna take this off. Look at that. Look at that, guys. So, anymore, I'm gonna just take it all off, to be honest, because look at that. Right here, it's starting to look like it's just slipping off slowly and slowly. But thankfully, the clamp is strong enough to kind of hold there, but I don't know, that clamp's probably just old. So, that's why I just popped off and decided to go bye bye. Just literally, I'm not seeing it anywhere. And since I don't have an under, under shield, I, I literally heard it like, dunk, dunk, dunk. So hopefully they didn't fuck up a tire or airline, but it don't look like I did. I should probably air up the car so I could check it out better, but. Um, so yeah, that's what happened. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the little, those little pulls. Uh, hope you guys saw a little more in that video on this uh, CAE short shifter. I still need a lot more seat time to kind of get used to this because I'm a little afraid. I don't know if you guys saw that. Like I wasn't letting go of the clutch as much because I was afraid. I was because, like I said, from the from the get go when I installed this, like these gears are like. I mean, I know it kind of has a lot. It looks like it has a lot of travel, but from stock to this, like literally, this is first, and then. This is third, so literally right next to each other. Of course, right next to each other. Look at look at this. Give me a better angle. Look first, and then this is third. <laughs> literally. So, you guys can see like they're like literally like butt buddies right now. Um. So yeah, it's it's. I'm a little scared. Kind of like God, I don't want that money shift. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Subscribe if you guys are new. Like I said, like this video if you guys, and of course, if you guys like those little pools. Um, comment down below what you guys want to see, what kind of content you guys want to see. If you guys want to see more uh, POV videos, probably outside. Like I said, I'm getting the little, the little screen, the little uh, windscreen fucking cover thing for this. Because I tried doing it, I tried doing outside the car view uh, on the hood so you can see some flames, but. It was just picking up a lot of wind noise, and that's honestly, I don't want to, I don't want to ruin you guys' uh, experience uh, on those POV videos. So I'd rather just wait for the, wait for the windscreen to come in, and then we'll go later in the day, and so you can see, so you guys can see the flames out the hood, and probably hear that the turbo more, a little, a little louder since it's gonna be outside the car. Um, but yeah, so subscribe if you guys are new, and uh, let's let's get let's get shit going. Uh, but that's enough for me talking, so peace out. Catch you guys in the next one.